joke of the day is coming up. Do you think school should have been closed today? I don't. Oh well. Better safe than sorry. Joke's coming up. It's one from Charlene Rowe. Thank you, Charlene. Here we go. 741 right now. It's time for this. Alright, joke of the day time here on Mix 106. This one's sent in from Charlene Rowe, another one from her, uh, emailed to me. So thank you, Charlene, for sending the jokes. Keep them coming, Charlene. Keep them coming. Carol from Durhamville. I love it, uh, getting these jokes sent in. Anyway, you can check out the joke of the day on the website, uh, wmcronline.com. We upload that every day to the website. You can check it out daily. And then uh, afterwards, if you missed one of the jokes, you can always go to youtube.com and just search for my joke of the day. And you will find a whole bunch of them. Every one of them is there on YouTube. If you just type in uh, uh, Joke of the Day Mix 106, you should find them all. Anyway, uh, log on to our website first, though, WMCRonline.com. Here you go, Joke of the Day. You ready? goes like this. George Phillips, an elderly man from Meridian, Mississippi, was going up to bed when his wife told him that he left the light on in the garden shed, which she could see from the bedroom window. George opened the back door to go uh, turn off the light, but saw that there were people in the shed stealing things. He phoned the police who asked, is someone in your house? And he said, no, but some people are breaking into my shed and stealing from me. So the police dispatcher said, all patrols are busy. You should lock your doors and an officer will be along when one is available. George said, okay. He hung up the phone and counted to 30. Then he phoned the police again. Hello, I just called you a few seconds ago because there were people stealing things from my shed. Well, you don't have to worry about them now because I just shot and killed them both. The dogs are eating them right now. And he hung up. Within five minutes, six police cars, a SWAT team, a helicopter, two fire trucks, a paramedic, and an ambulance showed up at the Phillips residence and caught the burglars red-handed. One of the policemen said to George, I thought you said you shot them. George said, I thought you said there was nobody available. I guess, I guess that's a, a true story they say here. They also say don't mess with old people. Okay, joke of the day. Thank you, Charlene Rowe, for sending that one in to me. And you can see it again on the website, wmcronline.com. Music for you from Paul McCartney and Wings. Oh, I love this one. Live and Let Die. Mix 106. Thank you, Charlene. Bye.